I'm going to put my two cents in on the OODA loop, the uh, observe, orient, decide, and act. Some people think the uh, orient is to orient your body towards whatever you observed, and that's not true. Boyd, John Boyd was a combat pilot, so if he's in his cockpit and he observes something over here, he can't orient his body to that. It's about orienting the information in your brain. So, uh, and even people who understand what the new loop stands for, they don't, they seem to not understand why they're even talking about it in the first place. All right. The reason this is even talked about is, it's, let's say you're shooting your AR or your AK with a bolt hold open. All right, so you're shooting, 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 click, you observe, right? But you don't wait. You don't wait to orient, decide, and act. You just observe, and then you go on to your reload. And by the time you're here, it's going to orient in your brain. Let's say you were shooting, pow, 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 and you got your click, and you observed a failure. But you just, you did a quick, like, like even James J says, it was too quick to even, you know, see. So you observe and you go on about the business, but then it orients, oh, there was a failure. So then from this position, you can go ahead and know you have a failure instead of putting a mag in and then finding out you have a failure. So, so and then if you, you're shooting, right, right, I don't have time to, to orient what just I saw, but by the time I'm continuing my mag change, it orients that nothing was wrong. I just had a bolt hold open. So I can just continue to reload and go about my business. That's the whole reason of Voodoo Loop. You observe and then you move on to acting before the reaction time goes full circle. That's what that's all about. They don't even know they're doing it. They just, they do that real quick because they see people on the internet doing it. But, and even the people that do it on the internet don't realize that's what they're doing. They're using Voodoo Loop. So that quick, I just oriented, I mean, I just observed the chamber was closed and everything is good to go. I just continue reloading. But if I had observed a failure, I wouldn't have had, I wouldn't have had time to orient, decide, and act. I would have went on about my business and then I would have oriented that there was a problem. That's the, that's the whole reason they talk about Oodaloo, is you observe something and then you just, you act to your basic what you're supposed to do until the human reaction time kicks in and then you can take over like scanning like if you're shooting shooting and you want to scan well don't okay all right uh okay everything's all right you just you just scan real quick you observe observe and then it's going to orient well there's something over there let me get back over here you know what i mean but you covered your bases all at once you observed everywhere and then you let it orient and then you can decide and act that's the whole thing with Uber.